Hello everyone, it's your bud. In today's video, I'm going to be reading a poem that I wrote. Now, sorry if you can hear my computer in the background, but it's starting to overheat. So, let's get into this. I would either call this the King of Snow slash the King of Sun, or the King of Winter slash the King of Spring. Alright, here we go. The old King of Snow, the largest to walk, usurped in his throne, awash in his loss. The new king of change chases the sun as the circle continues and others have won. To endure, to pursue, to have luck from above, we pass on our genes and we pass on our love. As the new spring arrives and greets the old king, his children know not what the cold winter brings. So they grow in the sun and then live in the cold as the new prince is born from the knowledge of old. As the new king of change claims his new throne, descendants move forth from the old kings of snow. Enduring the winter, the children of change learn to live with the land as they grow through the age, and the knowledge and wisdom for which they are known made them the masters, the new kings of snow. When the bounty of spring appears on the land, the time of return will be close at hand. The first and the last had the same chance to live. Any place, any change can make a new king. Well, I know that doesn't really end with a rhyme there, but that was my poem. So the king of snow, or the king of winter, was the polar bear, and the king of sun, or the king of spring, was the orca. As the ice melts and allows more sea to come in, the orcas come into the north and are having just a field day, pretty much. As much as I absolutely hate global warming, global warming has really, really sped up this process of melting the ice, which means there's less room for polar bears, the old kings of snow, and that there's more rooms for the kings of spring, which are the the orcas. So in this future, that in the, so in the future, I don't really know whether there's going to be polar bears or if there's just going to be orcas up in the north. I don't know. It's a very very confusing time right now. Now this is more for like the uh, winter spring cycle. I really really did like that, and I wanted to put it in a poem. But it, it also is reflecting the whole like the really big bad global warming problem that's happening right now. So the old king of snow, whether we make him leave or whether nature makes him leave, it's just as bad. And then the new king of change is the orca, and as much as I absolutely hate what global warming has done, at least the orcas are taking advantage of it. So yeah, hopefully you enjoyed that. Hopefully it gave you something to distract you from all the nonsense going on in the real world right now. So yeah, the king of snow and the king of sun. Leave this video a like if you want me to do more poems. I do have more. I have lots more original stuff that I did. Now I gotta go lie down. I'm feeling pretty bad, and this is about all I could do. So thanks very much for watching, leave us a like if you want some more poems, subscribe for daily videos. I make at least one video every day, sometimes even two or three in a single day. Yeah, leave any questions or suggestions in the comments below, and I'll see you in tomorrow's video. Thanks for watching!